Hello everyone, Sonic Sam41 here. We're back on the right file. Alright, let's continue. Sonic, you sure this is the right way? I saw Shadow and Eggman head this way. This has got to be the right way. But it's so spooky here. Maybe that's the ghost of Shadow we saw earlier. Knuckles can be a real jerk sometimes. Hey, what's Knuckles doing ahead of Sonic? That doesn't even make sense. Whoa. What? I guess that other guy's dead, but whatever. Yeah. What? What's going on? Oh come on! Oh well, I guess it's just a little limp over here. This case can be. You can punch this, or you can just use Rocket Cell and break it. I just find Rocket Cell more fun. Key number one here again. I'm not gonna get it. Just don't need it. <sighs> right, checkpoint one. And use knuckles to break these boards. Uh, there any, yep, there's a uh, Sonic power up right here. You know, in retrospect, I probably shouldn't power up tails, but damn, whatever. Jump is sort of unnecessary, but whatever. This guy. If you turn him inside out as Sonic by using the wind, uh, he turns into a s different enemy, that big fat guy. He starts absorbing r rings in the other form. In the form he was in, all he does is um, he heals enemies nearby him, so he's good to uh, destroy right away. Let Sonic take care of this. Right. Jump on these. Whoa. Platforms up ahead. Not a bad idea, Sonic. Alright, let's use Team Blast here so we can get power-ups for someone other than Sonic. There's that little fat jerk up ahead. Alright. You didn't die from it? Well, take this! How do you like that? It's not so good now, is it? And I'm talking to no one again, huh? Got it. Here we go. Leave it to me. Got it. Okay. Off the thing. And onto the switch. Why are you surprised by this, Sonic? I mean, it's already happened like four times. Leave it to me. Let's go. All right, take these guys. Whoa. Got it. All right, more targets to hit. Now take that advice to heart, because I didn't. And I blew it off. And I died. So, listen to what he's saying. You gotta time this well, or it's not gonna work. Make sure the thing is coming back when it's floating. Don't try to catch it when it's floating away. That's just not a good idea. His extra fly in case you need it. I don't know why you would unless you're back there and you're desperate. I guess. You know what? Just blow your shields away like that. Don't like it, do you? Right. Um. Behind here, instead of going straight ahead, turn around. There's a switch, you can get a lot of money. What's it doing here? Alright, right here, whoop. I'd recommend being Tails, because it's easy to fall off. You gotta follow these torches, make sure you're in between them at all times. 
course we're okay. No problem. All right. Break through the wall. That did nothing. Oh right, that's a different team. Up here is the switch. Oh, come on. Hey. Thank you. See, he's just turned into something different. Oh, or he did turn into something different. Yeah. Don't want to turn into that other different thing. It's not good. Oh, oh, that took care of that. Oh, another shield. <laughs> All right, enemy up ahead, I think it's falling. Or not. Thought there was. Come on, get the knuckles power up. There we go. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Tails? All right, now everyone's up. Sweet. There's something weird about this tower. Let's try to find out what's up. Got it. Shit. Of course, there's something weird about this tower. It's like a haunted mansion. Except this mansion isn't about a green gentleman who goes around go. sucking ghosts into his Maybe vacuum. So, yeah. Whoa. I guess we'll take him down if we fell anyway, but. No big deal. If it was higher up, I'd probably be a little more angry, but... Eh, no big deal. Jeez. Oh, there were more enemies. Oh, wait, I guess there was a guy, but... Yeah, he can't be destroyed. Uh, where's that other guy? There he is. Again, why are you surprised by this? I mean, it's already happened a bunch of times. We. Right. I'll just use this because I can. Well, that was convenient. Pay attention to the statue. Eggman's got some serious problems. Look at that statue. Besides being ugly, watch it when we flip upside down here. That's all I'm gonna say. through a series of pole things. So this game is getting a little weirder and weirder as time goes on. Whoa. That was close. And now, Mad Dash! Got it. Ready to jump! jump. Here we go. And get ready to jump! Let's and go. get ready to avoid giant spike ball things! Whoa, that was close. Yes. And go. get ready to jump! Let's jump. And now just sprint. Sweet, that's the end of that level. A A A A. Yeah. That was tight. All right, I'm gonna guess that this is a longer video, going to be a longer video. So uh, I apologize if that interferes with anything. Well said, Sonic. Well said. Not bad. Yeah. Oh, Here we go. Got it. Is there a... I think there... Oh, that must be somewhere else. I thought there was a thing up there. Oh, Tails, again. You Wouldn't you be expecting it by now? Alright. Break the crates. Knuckles. Switch. And now this magical thing of wonder is... exposed, I guess. Can you stop punching the thing and hit the enemy? Thank you. 
Alright, first key up here, obviously. Watch out for those shadows. If you stand on it, they're gonna fall. And and by don't step on that shadow, it means don't step on it for long, because you want it to come down at one point. Like that, so you can get it right out. And watch up, there's a, uh, en watch out, there's an enemy up here, I think. Oh, nope, again, probably another spot that I'm thinking of. But, uh, be careful, because sometimes there are enemies up there waiting for you, and they can hit you on the head and... <sighs> Shield, I'll take it. Alright, you want to destroy these guys to fill up your blast gauge, because... See those paintings? Well, it's sort of foreshadowing for what's going to happen, and you can guess. Oh no, I never expected that to happen. Yes, the paintings come to life when you hit the switch. Unfortunately, you have to hit the switch, otherwise you can't move on. Uh, what you want to do here is Team Sonic, just wait for that blast gauge to go down, because there's an enemy up ahead, and it's going to interact and screw you up when you try to do the pole jump thing. Like that, only it would have been a lot worse. So. Alright, there's that enemy I was talking about. He's already like that. Whoa. Alright, Bob's Sled. This is where... It actually gets difficult to drive, so, uh, it's power up tails. Why not? Leave it to me. Jump. Jump now. I'm gonna try and get Knuckles to power up, I guess it's gonna be tails again, but whatever. Use the brakes to jump. Be the brakes. I already explained this in, like, five episodes ago, Sonic, but thanks a lot, anyway. Uh, there... Never mind. I didn't say anything. I'm just again, think of another place. This castle sort of symmetrical. You can press either button, but this is the one that's actually going to help you progress, so I'd recommend touching it. Alright. Um, right here, there are going to be split paths of rails. I'd just recommend being tails. <laughs> I didn't mean to rhyme, but I did. Um, just to, for safety reasons. Whoop! Oh, see? Like that. Let's try this jerk over here. Alright. And to get that cage open, you're just gonna destroy this punk. Get the fan back at full power, hit the switch, and triangle jump. Triangle dive. Triangle jump is a thing on the wall. Oh no, the pit of despair! Oh wait, it has springs. Never mind. Alright. Again, you want to save your team blast. Don't waste it on these guys. Uh, bit of advice. If you don't have a full team blast gauge, you can just start punching his knuckles like this and then hitting the ground. And, uh, it usually fills up a little bit. It takes a while, but you can fill up the gauge by doing that, if you need to. Alright, this is why. Look! It's like the enemy from before, but he has a helmet. And stronger armor. So you can only hurt him by knocking him on the ground. And then, um... And then hitting his head. Otherwise, you can't hurt that enemy. It's really, really annoying. Alright, now... Down the fountain. And I guess everyone's powered up, so it doesn't matter who hits the bobsled. So let's do this. Let's beat these armored train things. Let's do it. We got this. We are. I just want to jump a lot, and you won't get hit by those spikes. But they shoot out. Oh. Whoa, that was kind of close. Right here, I recommend being tails again for safety reasons and then up ahead there is a pumpkin thing so watch out yeah I'm gonna get him out of here once you get close enough there we go. Oh. all right get ready ah dang it oh well anyway Right here, in case you don't have a key with you, you can go up here, up this ledge, 
And there is a key right here, if you need it. I'll just get double keys. I don't think it does anything, so... But whatever. Alright. I don't like this part at all. It's really easy to die here, so watch out. And it's too far to fly, so... Right here, you want to... Yep. You want to hold or tap B and get off the wall. B tails here again for safety reasons. Get the thing's attention. Come on. There we go. Now up ahead, up here is where the enemy is. So make sure you get him before you uh, before you ride up, or he's gonna hit you in the head, and it's gonna be bad. You can either go down there or take the chain thing. It doesn't matter. Um, before you activate the switches, you want to get all these pumpkin freaks out of the way. So you want to have to deal with them later. Alright, so drop him off, him off, and him. And then... Light Dash! Alright, each altar tests a character's ability. So, you want to jump, 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 jump. jump. Jump, 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 jump. If you have Team Blast like I do, hang on to it. It's going to be helpful up ahead. Alright, so that altar's taken care of. Let's go to this one. Uh, I never explained this. Uh, if it makes any, if it's any help, R and L control the camera angle, in case you need to adjust that. So. Sorry, I didn't mention that earlier. I probably should have. Alright, wait for this to rise up. Oh! No! Oh. Wait for this thing to come back your way. There we go. That's better. Just to be safe. And destroy this little jerk over here. Come on. There we go. Guess what you gotta do to get back? Triangle dive. And another one of this, these guys. So again, just use your team blast that I told you to hang on to. And he's taken care of. Whoa, that was weird. And you're out of here. And I guess we're going to the special stage. Sweet! I'm guessing B. No way, sweet. Perfect. What stinks right there is as you come out, um, you can potentially fall into the water and die. And have to redo a lot of that level again. Which would absolutely stink. So be careful. All right, Emerald Challenge. Take it nice and slow, and speed up a little bit when you. But when you get back to the spikes, slow down. And then try to catch up with the Emerald. Speed up, speed up. Sweet. The key into getting most of these emeralds is making sure you don't hit the spikes. Even if you're going a little slower, it's better than hitting spikes. And we got a three up. Sweet. Guess what time it is? Well, boss time, but... More specifically... Robots... Trying to stop us now? <laughs> what a joke! What did you say? Now I'm really I don't see how that would get you really, really mad like that. But uh, whatever. I'm not a evil scientist. Sweet. That's actually pretty cool. How they're like helping me in the back right there. That's it's pretty nice of them. All right, knuckles time. Alright, I say knuckles time again. 
<laughs> Sonic is already all the way leveled up. Alright. Alright, now is when I would recommend using Team Blast. Sonic and destroyed them, but I didn't. Oh well. Jeez, I'm not doing so well. There's that last guy. Use knuckles for this part, just so because. Oh, come on! Thank you. It's because it's easier to destroy them that way. You can get that balloon right there if you fire it as knuckles, but uh, it doesn't really matter. It's probably just a shield or something. Whoa, I thought it was knuckles. I honestly did. <laughs> that would have been a problem if I pressed B another time. Rocket Excel right off the edge. Uh, I think I'm thinking this. Yep. That's it. All right. That was efficient. Whoa, you're still alive? Fine, do that way. Just bounce on your head. Be tails for this part, just because there are a lot of flying enemies. And if you're powered up all the way, it's just really easy. Just keep pressing the B button. Sweet. My team blast already filled up all the way. Alright, I'd save my team blast if I were you and just destroy these enemies with tails. Or anyone. Doesn't matter. Yeah, I again I apologize for the length of the video, but I just wanted to include all of Hank Castle in it. Whoa, that's not meant to be tails, but whatever. All right. This is why you want to use Save Team Blast, because it's filled with all the harder enemies you've dealt with so far. It's just so much easier if you use Team Blast here. <laughs> 